Okay, I've just arrived here at a office building. Uh, we're just up here in Coolum Beach, and basically they've seen a snake uh, on the move in the office building, and luckily I found it pretty quickly. But you've got an office uh, desk here, and um, you know nothing, nothing too obvious yet. But just wait and see. It's lucky I found it. It's lucky people weren't working up here. So if I just move this little tray out, still can't see him. <laughs> I don't want to put my hand in there. That there is a carpet python. There we go, bit of light. <laughs> in the bottom pigeonhole of uh, this office, isn't that crazy? You wouldn't even know he's there. No. He's probably been living there for a while, has he? Oh, no, I'd say he's only come in in the last sort of 24 hours. Oh, but. Okay. He looks quite at home there, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, he's pretty comfy <laughs> on top of the uh, the files, that's for sure. But uh, we'll get him out of there and, and back out in the bush. Yep. <gasps> there, there he is. is. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at that. He's pretty he's big. In, yeah, he's fit, he's gorgeous. He, he's basically touching all sides of the... Uh, oh, can I take a one? picture of him too? Yeah, I'll, um, I'll just chuck him in the bag and then we can get some photos or something. Oh, how yeah, gorgeous. Let's get this little python out of here and back out in the bush, eh? I thought he was a python. Oh, look, he doesn't want to go in. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to go Ooh. in, do you? I was going to let him chill there. Yeah. That's right. We'll get some photos of him before I put him away anyway. Oh, thank you. It's his bag now. <laughs> hey, guys, just here at our office, uh, sort of library building. Uh, in Bly Bly. Excuse my voice, there's got a bit of a croaky flu at the moment, but we've got a baby eastern brown snake. But I want to show you where he was hiding. So I was very lucky that I was using my hook as I try and get into a good habit of doing for this exact reason. So they last saw him going sort of into one of these holes of the shelving unit. Now I lifted this up with my hook, right? and saw underneath nothing there i checked all four of them then i went and checked the whole room and i came back and checked him again couldn't find him i thought no he has to be here somewhere so i luckily used my hook again as i lifted this up he just appeared and i was like where the heck have you come from but see on the inside here there's actually a groove and he was sitting in that groove so it's very lucky that I didn't get complacent and just lift this up like that or else I would have put my fingers straight on him. So, yeah, it just sort of shows the crazy spots, especially little snakes like this, can hide in. It's, you've opened this filing cabinet. Yeah. And, and there he was. Okay, and we don't know what it is. It could be a tree snake, but um, better to be safe than sorry, that's for yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 the cool snakes I wonder if the cool snakes, ones that get cake ones. Oh, the Kilgax? Yeah, yeah, no, they're cool, the Kilgax. Might still, might still be in the top one. Maybe. Yeah, here's something. Yeah, here's something. Well, I'm really glad that I didn't um, lift him out. Didn't hurt him. I hopefully. got his drop the shoulder one day. I was out yeah. in front of him. He fell out of the bush under his shoulder. Pulled across my back and went down off the ground. I'm sitting on with uh, him with me. Chopped two movies to get out of the way. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so this doesn't happen very often, but the uh, clients are more than happy to have the snake back in their backyard. They just want him out of the house now, the filing cabinet. So, very stunning colours on this common tree snake. If I can. Here we go. He is pretty. He is very pretty. <laughs> Alright, I'll put him um right, off you go. And off you go. Yep. yep. Just received a call. Uh family in Sippy Downs have seen a brown coloured snake inside. Uh, the kids saw it about an hour ago, so not sure if doors will be left open. They basically evacuated the house. It was last sort of seen cruising around their bedroom, I believe, or in the hallway. So we're going to head over now and hopefully we can find it. What was it? Not sure. What was that? I'm not sure what it was. It was a kill back or a brown snake. In fact, I think it's a brown snake. I literally put oh. this open and it just dropped. Lean towards Brown. Where's it going? It went. Oh no. It's got a gap in the couch and it went up. Just hold on, dude. That's not a no. This is it. Houdini. Oh. Holy dooly. Hey, don't come That's up there. It's bigger than I thought. Far out. Which way is it going? Just there, just chilling. I've got eyes on it. Drill the hook. Did you find it? Yeah, it's just there. He's going around the back. He is. That's right, I've taken a look. <laughs> oh no. Sorry. <laughs> just over there. <laughs> Not happy. I might come back towards you. Yeah, gotcha. You're in the bag, but. Oh, no. This is one of the big ones. This is one of the big ones. Okay, he's out. Now Eastern brown, second most venomous snake in the world. Under a couch, eh? Wow. Yeah. Just have a look at the bloody. <laughs> Mate, it's a bloody crime scene in here. <laughs> Alright, a bit breezy, but can't believe that this bloody brown snake was in a couch. Far out. Yeah. Alrighty, job has come in. Uh, Sippy Downs. Possible big python. Uh, they've got a few pets in the backyard, so need it relocated. So we're gonna head straight down there now, get it out of the yard and back into the bush. G'day. Hey, how you going, mate? Good, how are you? Yeah, good. Come on in. G'day. G'day, mate, how are you? I've been standing guard. It's tucked in behind that brown pot. Standing guard? Yeah. All right, what have we got here? Oh yeah, nice little, nice little python. What I'll do? No, that's all right. I might just see if you'll come out nice and gently. 
still pretty cold. I'm surprised it's not. <laughs> yeah, we're we're professionals. <laughs> Beautiful snake. Yeah, yeah, like it is still quite, still quite cold. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful python. Can he bite you? He can. I'm just being nice and gentle. Okay. So, um, beautiful snake. But he's probably due for a feed. He's a little bit skinny for his length, but still a beautiful snake. We've got a snake on the move in the school grounds at pickup time. So the uh, I think it's the cleaners doing their best to keep away uh, all the kids, just telling them, right, kids, time to go home, leave the snake alone, and uh, we're going to duck down now. Obviously, school traffic's pretty bad. Have my afternoon snack and hopefully catch this snake and get it out of there. Mmm. Oh. Beautiful snake. He is the centre of attention. Don't come around the corner, kids. You're right. Hey, you're right. Here he is. Beautiful snake. So good. Don't do this at home, kids. <laughs> Snakes are starting to be on the move, just like this guy, as you can see. Keen to get out of the bag. All right, bud. You can go back in the bush. Back away from the school and all the kids. Healthy snake. It may be a male on the search for a female. Well, there'll be plenty in there for you, buddy.